As Texoma continues to grow, so does the need for building materials like concrete. News 12's Austin Hedgecoth was at Kid Key Auditorium tonight, where once again a proposed construction plant was the center of attention. Last week, Kid Key Auditorium was filled with Denison residents speaking out against a proposed concrete crushing plant. On Tuesday, Van Alstein residents sat in the very same seats with very similar concerns. The issue at hand, a proposed concrete batch plant to be built along Highway 75 just north of Van Alstein. We have a large senior citizen population in Van Alstein. Health is a major issue. Concrete batch plants combine materials like sand, water, and cement to create ready-mix concrete. That mixture is then loaded into trucks and taken out to construction sites. Batch plants are common in areas of high development, but some residents feel this one is in the wrong spot. As I understand it, it's got to go somewhere. Ladies and gentlemen, Van Alstein is not the place it needs to go. The meeting gave residents a chance to ask questions directly to staff from the company that wants to build the plant. They also had a chance to speak with representatives from the Texas Commission on Environmental Quality, the group that will eventually decide whether to approve or deny the permit. I lost my father to breathing in things he shouldn't have breathed in. He had to get a lung transplant. He died at 68 years old. I don't want to have that fate. I want to live. At the end of the meeting, residents were able to add their concerns to the record. They can also submit their comments online until Thursday. Then the TCEQ will have 30 days to make its final decision. I hope that they're paying attention to us. I'm not too sure. News 12 will continue to follow this important story. In Sherman, Austin Hedgecoff, News 12.